Welcome back to another Climb product walkthrough. I'm Lucas Eddy, and today we're looking at the new F3 Carbon Pro Off-Road Helmet. You guys know our F3 Carbon Helmet. It's super popular, super lightweight. We've had a lot of success with it. We really enjoy the feedback riders are giving us about that helmet because it's so light and so comfortable. They're like, oh no, it can't be that light. You hand it to them, they're like, what? This is so light. So anyways, we upgraded that helmet with the F3 Carbon Pro here. There's a few key differences, but first we'll go over what is the same. So starting on the outside of the helmet with the vents, there are 13 intake vents all throughout the front of the helmet and six exhaust vents throughout the back. We'll get to the ventilation a little bit more here in a second, but that's what we see on the outside in terms of ventilation. The same thing on the outside is this hand laid carbon fiber shell. What hand laid means is the fibers are actually pre-impregnated with resin and then they're hand laid in here. So into the shell shape. So what that means is we get way fewer imperfections, no bubbles, no differences in resin distribution because it's not painted on afterwards or applied afterwards. Um, so it's really, really efficient resin distribution. So we get a light and really strong and really consistent shell throughout this whole thing, all this carbon fiber. So there are a couple other things that are similar here with the regular F3 carbon helmet as well. And that's this Fidlock mechanism right here, the magnetic buckle release. This is super awesome, super glove friendly. You just pull this red tab right here and it comes apart and you just get them close to each other and they lock right in. It's rated to like 400 something pounds, I think. So really strong, really easy. Once you use this, you're never gonna go back to D-rings. Trust me, it's so convenient. So here we go. What's different about this helmet, about the F3 Carbon Pro compared to the regular? First thing you'll notice is this visor. It's more pointed, it's more aerodynamic, it's stronger, and it gives you better visibility. When you're like going up a hill climb and looking through, uh, looking through your goggles through the visor, it gives you a little bit more visibility looking up those hills. We like that visibility, durability, aerodynamics, all that stuff is good stuff. Another thing that sets it apart is this choroid material in here, which is this green straw-like material. Let me pull the liner out so we can see it better. So you can see these sections of green choroid material. That does two things. One is it improves impact absorption. So instead of like this multi-layer EPS that we have throughout the rest of the helmet, which the EPS foam was kind of like bouncy in a way, like it can be impacted and it rebounds a little bit. Choroid, when it's impacted, it crushes homogeneously, which means the same. It, it crushes really consistently throughout that whole structure, and it doesn't rebound. You get much better impact absorption properties in those particular areas. So we like that. The other thing this does is it allows more airflow through those straw-like structures because they're hollow. So your hot air from your head is just going to float up, and then the air flowing through the helmet is going to take that heat away. So it gives you a little bit better uh, ventilation there as well. So we've got improved visibility and durability with the visor. We've got improved ventilation and improved impact absorption characteristics in here with the F3 Carbon Pro. And the last question you might have is how the weight compares to the regular F3 Carbon, which is extremely light at just over 1100 grams for a size large, size small, for example, would be a lot less weight than the large, uh, but we always weigh our larges because that's kind of in the middle of the whole scheme of uh, shapes and sizes. So to answer that question, how much it weighs, it's literally just a handful of grams heavier than the F3 Carbon regular. So it's still a super, super light helmet. I'm a big fan of this. We wore this uh, in Turkey racing at Sea to Sky in October of 2022. So check those videos out too if you wanna see these helmets in action. They held up awesome. One of them even got stolen at some point. So that must mean that the local kids really like these things. <laughs> Anyways, that's about it for the F3 Carbon Pro helmet. If you guys have any questions, hit us up in the comments. Find us on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok. I think that's all the social medias. That's where we are. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching, guys.